Hi guys, I'm Shmi. Hello and welcome back to the channel where you join me today to visit what I think we can call the most luxurious car showroom in the world. Today I'm heading to Rolls-Royce Motor Cars in London, the new HRO and showroom in the heart of Mayfair, to go and take a look around at some of the experience. And not only that, Rolls-Royce are very kindly sending a new ghost extended wheelbase to come and pick me up very shortly to head into the centre of London to go and visit the new Rolls-Royce London showroom. And right on cue, we have the arrival of the majestic Rolls-Royce Ghost Extended Wheelbase, the new model of Ghost that I experienced in its regular form factor recently, the extended wheelbase offering a little bit more legroom and passenger space in the rear. This particular car, by the way, is looking stunning in the emerald green paintwork with the orange coach line around the side, where we're joined today by Jack. How are you? Good morning, not too bad. How are you? Very good. Good to see you. You too. We'll be heading into town today, but you're often seen as well at the wheel of these things going up the Goodwood Hill Climb and that kind of thing. Yes, today's a little bit more laid back and nice and comfortable. Uh, in a few <laughs> weeks time, we'll be back at Goodwood for the famous Festival of Speed. Definitely. And exciting cars. Absolutely fantastic. Well, this is stunning. The Ghost, of course, is a 6.75 litre twin turbocharged V12, 571 horsepower, 850 newton metres of torque. This particular example is lovely. Can we take a look? in the back the dual tone with the black and the grace white loaded with technology but very much the luxurious features and details that come to, we've come to expect from a rolls royce which we'll be experiencing today along with the silence and magical ride and the motorized doors always fantastic so shall we head on if you're ready we shall head over to rolls royce motor cars london let's go let's take a step on board then this color is really really magnificent of course we've got the lovely carpets beautiful specification and then when inside the button on the door frame to close it and by the way actually let's completely close it one thing about the ghost is that to open the door you can do a double pull and it will pull itself with the motors open as well which is magnificent right let's close that up and we'll be uh, set to head onwards I feel like this is going to be a very enjoyable journey nice relaxed drive while we make our way then in towards central London, let me show you a little bit more of the experience here in the Rolls-Royce Ghost extended wheelbase and what it's like being a passenger, being chauffeur driven. Everything that you can touch is the finest possible in terms of materials. The leathers, all of the details that you can see around, this very large single piece for the door cards, the spirit of ecstasy here, but even the speaker grills, the door handle, there's actually a volume control just here. And you also have the infotainment, which can open out from the seat in front of you You've got the table that folds open, followed by the display screen as well, where you can run through the different options and set everything up from there. You've got another button to close it all away as well. You can have just the tray open should you prefer. You've got these very lovely looking air conditioning vents and even the controls here in the center are the traditional style. Why change them if you don't need to? Everything has a very premium and high quality feel to it. If we come towards the central tunnel and what we have here between the two seats in the back, you can actually pop open this flap where you've got the controller for the infotainment again you can press here and open up the screen depending which side you'd rather have out and then interact with it as well using the toggle to go through the various different screens and settings to repeat your navigation display up here to control the audio or whatever it might be that you'd like to have then just beneath that you've got your seat controls with lumbar you've also got the ability to control the seat in front if you'd like a little bit more space from that let's close this back away close this for the second as well over on this side You've got your seat heating control, you've got some memory buttons there as well, and a big door pocket just below. But even just looking around, it is all a very, very, very lovely place. Up top, the Starlight Headliner, where you can change the settings, you can brighten it and darken it, depending how you'd like it to be. You've also got a vanity mirror here that folds down. Just everything in the Rolls-Royce feels absolutely magnificent the feel the fit the finish the quality of materials all of the details and then here in the armrest as well if we open this up look what we've got inside there some 12 volt charging sockets as well and even if we continue further back you can pop open this open up back here as well and you've got a champagne cooler where you can have your bottle of champagne ready nice and cool to enjoy the ride in this car that just sitting between the seats which are finished as well with some lovely stitching around the side of them so it really is 
a wonderful place to be. A really, really nicely finished car and the specification of this as well, with some more of the orange stitching details, just adds to it an awful lot. Not to mention the very calm, very peaceful ride. Oftentimes it feels like you're basically standing still even when you're cruising along just because it's so smooth and so quiet. Even with the cars going past us here. Not really aware of the outside world at all. Not far to go now as we head up Sloan Street, past some of the designer stores and shops on our way towards Rolls-Royce London. Still a very, very calm way to explore and enjoy the city without all of the hustle and bustle. We are arriving then here at the new Rolls-Royce Motor Cars showroom. Have a look at this. We'll head round and be able to go inside where this instantly looks special. Some stunning cars inside itself. Wow, let's go have a look. Here we are then, and even from the outside, this is a special place. In fact, have a look at the entranceway to the new showroom, replicating the Pantheon grille that you find at the front of a Rolls-Royce itself, and even up above, the Spirit of Ecstasy, made by the same manufacturer as the Spirit of Ecstasy worn on the very front of the cars. This is the flagship showroom that's just been opened, launching here in London, and also over in Shanghai as well, very shortly thereafter, the new visual identity. Let's head inside because we're going to go and explore in the Atelier, the Speakeasy, the Cabinet of Curiosity and many more things that feature in the new Rolls-Royce showroom. Welcome then to Rolls-Royce London. Let's have a walk around here. We'll take a good look at some of the cars featuring, including Phantom 8. We have the Wraith Black Badge and over towards this side, the Dawn Black Badge, a Cullinan and a Ghost as well. But there's a lot to experience. This is the Speakeasy bar area. Then we have the Atelier, which we're going to go and explore. There are some fantastic things to take in in there. Over here is one of my favourite parts of the new visual identity. This is the Cabinet of Curiosity, where as you can see there are plenty of different items to inspire, to give ideas that might lead towards specifications of various different cars. But of course this is really the new era for Rolls-Royce. You can see it's a very visual era in terms of the displays, the screens, the images, the whole experience, the mirrors that you can spot all around as well, making the cars really stand out. And we've got some brilliant examples actually to look at here, including the Phantom 8 that I experienced back when it launched. Really the flagship pinnacle of luxury, often of course for chauffeur driving, but also a great experience to actually drive yourself as well. This particular car, as you can see, has the crystal paint over the bonnet and you can see some of the metallic flake within that paint, but it also is contrasted with what Rolls-Royce call their iced paint, the matte satin black that you can see around for a really very impressive appearance. And then the replication, of course, of the grille that we've seen from the outside being inspired by this as well with the gloss black Spirit of Ecstasy at the front, which tucks itself back down as well. In the side here, of course, the Phantom carries the gallery. So on the dashboard, you have this very bespoke element where you can configure and design exactly what goes in there, working directly with the factory if you wanted to go beyond what we're going to see in the Atelier very shortly in terms of the customization that can be done here. If we come through, have a look at this black badge Wraith. The Wraith, of course, being the sporty coupe-like car that we could say, but this is finished again with the crystal paints. Very metallic. We've got the white against the black with these lime green accents that you can see, including on the center of the wheels, where the center cap itself will always rotate to point in the correct direction. And you've got that line that runs all the way down over the shoulder, matching with the interior finish, which as always is absolutely stunning. Now I want to come and take a look as well at this particular Dawn. Dawn black badge as well. The black badge giving you some of these chromed or dark chromed elements, the black elements that you can see around the car as well, but very much the more powerful, more performance orientated version, but still very much about elegance, comfort, style. And you can see that completely with the Dawn. This also has the aero cowling over the back. This is actually installed. It's a two person operation, but you've got the carbon fiber accents and it gives it a completely different silhouette and profile having that shape of the rear buttresses over the back. Truly elegant, an option that can be specified on the cars. And don't forget, by the way, that the coach line is hand painted down the side of these cars, but just look at the lights, the reflections, the appearance in here. Have a look at this as well. Special light feature over the top of the Cullinan black badge here. This actually adjusts depending on which car is underneath it, doing different 
actions, movements, even different light shows, depending on the specifics of what exactly wants to be shown. This is a place you could spend a lot of time just exploring, looking around, taking in all of the details. This is the new Ghost, the regular car, which is 15 centimeters shorter than the extended that we now have outside, where sadly it has just started to rain. But this is the new Ghost in Salamanca Blue. It's been a very popular color in recent years for Rolls-Royce, contrasted with the gloss black wheels you have that particular example but if we come through then to have a look through here this is of course about making more of an experience for customers coming to the speakeasy to join at the bar to have a drink to talk about specifications ideas to be part of the family and this is so much the direction at the moment making these kind of experiences quite literally that quite literally experiences beyond just the purchase of a car for example here take the best that exists and make it better a brilliant quote quote by Sir Henry Royce. But I want to come in and show you in here, in the atelier, because this is the kind of thing that always particularly intrigues me to look at different specs and options. And this is just a dream. Of course, the configurator will allow you to run through a host of different options, whether that's choosing your exterior colors and just look at the range of different options that we have here from the purples, for example. This is particularly nice twilight purple. And then down below, if we pop open the drawers, have a look at these as well. Some of the contrast so that you can imagine what your specification would look like. Let's say we pop twilight purple against silver or even inverted that and it's silver against the purple this is always the perfect way to be inspired and to consider different options more of the iced colors that feature here as well can spend forever looking at these we've got some of the inlays and trim ideas from the woods to the piano black to the different styles the different finishes the different effects and over here some of the samples for gallery the opportunity to be able to create bespoke finishes inside to choose from some of the options that are available but to also work with the factory to go totally bespoke to include a piece of artwork or a toy car or you name it just about anything else next to that we've got the starlight headliner that rolls royce really made famous and even with this there's the bespoke option to set it to a configuration of the stars from a specific date could be your date of birth could be anything and you can occasionally spot as well the shooting stars that blast across we had those in the extended wheelbase ghost as well but more bespoke features lovely details i want to come and show you as well these and exactly what we've got going on with the leather samples that we have here because this is also fascinating to me these are shaped like umbrellas that you have within the car except you pull these out and you can then unroll it as you can see these two here so you can get an idea for your dual tone configuration that you'd like to have in the car and the finished product as well as getting the paint samples out to put this together to create the finished result for a car to look at stitching and believe me these drawers and cupboards are all filled with different options and ideas and this is very much invitational for customers who are building their bespoke spec to come here from goodwood to mayfair to go and build and create the car exactly as their dreams would love it to be to create something very very special for example the different cars that we have here in the showroom at the moment unfortunately london being london the weather has truly turned but what a great opportunity to come and visit hron rolls royce motor cars here in the heart of mayfair the hustle and bustle of the city as you can see buses traffic you name it and now to be heading off as well in the ghost ewb and i tell you what this emerald green paint under the rain actually looks really magnificent the brighter highlights that you can see it is a very very nice shade and i imagine with bright sunshine out on it as well this car would also look spectacular but as showrooms go as experiences of purchasing such cars go this is really the most luxurious i think in the world the new rolls royce showroom here in central london a big thanks to hron and to rolls royce for the opportunity to share it with you today and to be able to take a look around at some of the extraordinary cars there as well but now we'll hop back on board the ghost and head on from here but thank you very much for watching as always guys your support is hugely appreciated that's it for this time and i'll see you again very soon cheers